Hey YouTube, it's Anthony again, coming back at you with another episode of Here in My Office. And um, I'm going to make more frequent uploads. Uh, the last video I is, did pretty good. But um, one thing I noticed is um, I'm getting success making shorts. And I made some shorts um, with my dog, so you can check those out. And um, we went out to Valley Forge Park yesterday and um, made made a few short videos. And they got like, like one of them got like 1,500, 1500 views in like hours. And I'm thinking like I make here in my office videos and it takes, it, it takes like a week to get like 150 views, which isn't a lot. So, um, and I... I need to grow my subscriber base to to a thousand so that it can monetize my channel, which is really uh, would really be helpful now. So, um, so yeah, I'm trying new things and um, you know hoping I can grow my channel. But uh, I'm looking for some feedback from my viewers. Like, what uh, what type of content do you really do you really enjoy? Do you really enjoy hearing my office videos and you care that much about my personal life? Or is there, should I do like toy reviews? Like my wife buys a lot of toys and I made a video on uh, a toy garbage truck and it had like, got like 20,000 views. It was a short, so I don't know how much of it is because it was a short, but uh, you know, it seemed to be uh, a way to get more views than what I usually get. Um, usually I didn't get so much. And we, my channel is now like four years old. I started this channel in 2018 when I got terminated from a job. And, uh, and it, I wanted to follow the progress of the, uh, of the lawsuit that I talked about for a long time. But then that ended up turning into shit. So, um, that, that content would have been much more exciting. I thought one of these days we were going to say, oh, we're settling for a lot of money. And, uh, but that never happened. So, um, so there's not really much to report on that anymore. My only option at this point is to, um, sue my ex attorney for malpractice. Um, but I don't have the money to do that. But if I did, I guess I could pursue him. But, I don't, so, you know, the money I have is going to be used for, uh, rent, <laughs> and, um, speaking of rent, I just signed another one-year lease on this place in Philadelphia, in Maniunk, and, um, you know, so, at least another year, and then hopefully the next goal is to get a house, but as you know from my last video... I said that I was uh, pursuing Social Security Disability. And uh, Social Security Disability wouldn't pay me as much as I would if I had a job. It would be significantly less money. But it's still money. And if I get it, then um, I could use that to pay a mortgage on a house. Um, you know, my credit, my credit's bad. It used to be, I used to have like an 820 credit score. Now it's like... 580 600 it's you know it's you need to have at least like a 620 credit score to get a to get a mortgage and mine still falls short of that for various reasons but uh, you know I joined Experian boost and I'm trying to fix my credit score a little bit and uh, what's really gonna help is that you know um, Getting a job would really help, but I'm in, right now I'm in this in this weird position where I'm I'm pursuing social security disability and I'm still waiting on it, but um, I'm still applying to jobs sometimes. Um, I haven't gotten any. Well, someone reached out to me on LinkedIn for Ally Financial for a job. Um, it was a audit manager. Um, paid good money. Um, I think it was remote too, but, uh, they said they were looking for somebody with cyber experience and, um, 
tech and cyber, which isn't really my wasn't really my area of focus over the years that I've been in audit. So um, it didn't sound like a good fit. Let's put it that way. So I haven't heard from them. I don't expect to hear from them. But, um, you know, I still have applications out once again at Wells Fargo. But, you know, because that's basically the reason I came to Philadelphia to work for Wells Fargo. And uh, here we are two and a half years later. But, you know, I'm thinking third time could be the charm. You know, I've I've messed up jobs over the last several years and um <sighs> but they keep giving me chances to come back and right now my resume is not looking the greatest because it you know it's showing that I work six months here six months there three months here and uh it's starting to look like I'm a job hopper and um you know but if it's all due to this bipolar if it's all due to my mental health then maybe I belong on disability. So hopefully they see that that way and they give me that, they give me that option. So, um, so that's all that's going on right now, guys. I uh, just wanted to make a quick update video. And if you like my videos, please give me the thumbs up and subscribe. Um, if you give me the thumbs up, that helps, that helps my videos get seen. Um, it'll help me grow my channel. So, so thanks guys. And uh, we'll talk to you next time.